What's going on everybody and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a really easy strawberry jam. To get this started, here I have 500 grams of strawberries. We're just going to carefully cut around the top and cut the root and stem out. Once that's done, we'll place them in a large bowl and pour over 500 grams of caster sugar. Using a spoon or a spatula, we're just going to mix all of the sugar into the strawberries. And what this does is it starts to macerate the strawberries, which means drawing the moisture out. When I'm going to put this aside, then with one lemon, we're just going to cut it in half and squeeze the juice out. Then in a large heavy base saucepan, we're going to pour in our strawberries and sugar. And for a sieve, we're just going to pour in our lemon juice. And what the lemon juice does is it brings the pH level down, helping it set and stabilize. We're then going to put this onto a medium to low heat, and then we're going to stir this until the sugar dissolves. And try not to break up the fruit. And now that our sugar is nearly melted, with a wet pastry brush dipped in hot water, we're just going to rub the sides down just to scrape off any of that excess sugar left on the side of the pan. Because if we leave any of the sugar on the side, it will crystallize and you'll get little big lumps of sugar throughout your jam. Once that's done and the sugar's fully melted, we're then going to put this onto a high heat and bring it to a boil. We're then going to boil this for about seven minutes. And if you have a thermometer, bring it to 105 degrees Celsius. And now that our candy thermometer reaches 105 degrees Celsius, we're going to turn it off the heat. And if you don't have a candy thermometer, a good way to check if it's ready is just get a little spoonful, place it into a cold ramekin, and place in the freezer for 45 seconds. Then once it's been in the freezer for 45 seconds, if you can run your finger through it, and it doesn't all run back into the line, then you're done. We're now going to allow this to cool down for about 10 to 15 minutes and then we can pour it into our sterilized jars. And now that our mixture's cooled down, we'll add our strawberries to the jar. Pour in our liquid. And you want to leave a centimeter gap between the liquid and the rim of the jar. Then going to pop a lid onto these. Now we're going to leave this overnight to set and allow it to completely cool down and then we'll come back tomorrow and see what result we got. Then 24 hours later, we're going to take the lid off. And there we have our beautiful strawberry jam. This is really easy to make and only requires three ingredients. And kept in a cool dark space, this will last up to three months. But as soon as you open the lid, you'll have to keep it in the fridge where it will last up to two weeks. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I was able to teach you something. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below to stay up to date with everything that I do on my channel. I post three videos a week on recipes, tips, tricks, and secrets. Don't forget to like, share, and comment. And if there's any recipes that you'd like to see me make, please leave them in the comment section down below and I'll be sure to make them. I hope you have a fantastic day. Thanks again for watching. Bye for now.